Truck. Driving that truck. I should. Mm-hmm. I wish I could have got that song on here. The song they played. Um, um, pre or prior. I'm stop playing those songs. Um, what's up? Welcome to another episode of the People's Mic. You are back. I'm here. Hey, this is your second time. I'm Greg Suarez. Yeah, it's my second time. Greg, on. Introduce yourself. I'm Greg Suarez. I'm a New York-based, you know, likable guy. Just a likable. Yeah. Guy. Also a comedian, but you know, I'm just gonna lead with what I know my strengths are. Yeah. Guy who doesn't make waves. That's me. Is it really? Yeah, You're I'm not a wave like, guy. I'm. I think I'm oh. like breaking into it, but no, nah, I generally. So, so you, you see, you're, you're the guy at work. You, you just do what you got to do. I do what I got to do. Fuck. Yeah. I wish, I wish I knew how to be that guy. If somebody says like something I disagree with about movies, it gets really intense. But only that. So that's still pretty mild. As soon as I know that there's tension. Yeah. You have to uh, now amplify it. Yeah. What's th- yeah? Have you done that recently? All the time. What I, 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 all the time. You're uh, a shit star. I am a shit. This is what my mom. Oh, oh. oh. Yeah. You gotta oh. mix it up. Mm. <laughs> oh. What's oh. the? Oh, you know so those little African ladies that 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 who like pounds the yeah, powder yeah, yeah, and yeah. make it into shit. I'm like. Mm. That's what you yeah. do instead of guacamole. Yeah. It's just people's problems yeah, and tensions problems and exactly. are just... So there's been situations where you could have avoided stern shit, but you're Probably, like, I'm absolutely. just getting in there. But yeah, I'm just, I'm just, oh yeah, just get the fuck in there. What do you like in the workplace when you're working like a regular job and you want to stir some shit up? What do I like? Yeah. Uh, um, I, I'm just loud and and <laughs> and, and I, I do the opposite of whatever the boss wants. Oh. Like, who, oh, I do whatever, that. Whatever, not even the boss, because sometimes I have fairly okay bosses. That, yeah. You know, and then it's, it's the, uh, whoever the authority, the piece of shit authority is. Yeah. Right? Like, whoever yeah. that person, there's always, no matter where I've ever worked, mm-hmm. there's always one person. There's always like, one you can piece get along of shit. With everybody. Yeah. And then they don't like that, and mm-hmm. then they, they'll do whatever they can to make you look bad. Oh, yeah. So then I was like, it's all. You've so always got to have a nemesis. Though. Oh, yes. It's, it's kind of good. That's, that, I, I guess that's it. the universe, right? Yeah. You can't ever yeah. be in a place where mm-hmm. everybody roots for you. No, no way. you got to have somebody to fight. Yeah. So, yeah. But you're all the better for it. I mean... No matter what situation. 100%. It's either the boss. It's either the, the guy that wants the job you have. Yep. Or, or sometimes... At my last job, the one that they I talked about in the last podcast, they fired me from... They brought in a trainee, and I'm like, oh, it's weird. They have two trainees at the same time. And then about halfway through, I'm like, oh, they're bringing her in because they're going to get rid of me. <laughs> I'm like, and they're like, can you train this girl? I'm train like, I'm going to train. And I knew it was oh, happening, but nobody was saying anything. Oh, So, damn. yeah, there's a couple Did of villains in that scenario. Did you fuck her though? You got to fuck No, she was a lesbian. She's she was definitely a lesbian. No, oh, neither of those fuck. things. Fuck. And, like, here, like you, you were supposed to, like, wear, like, collared shirts. The girl came in wearing, like, a Biggie small sweatshirt oh, every knew, day. She, she knew. She and, she, and they still were like, yeah. no, we're going with yeah. her. Yeah. We're going with her. I wore a tie, and they're still like, doesn't they matter. You that much. Yeah. They're like, we're going with the girl in the Biggie sweatshirt with the Yo. mustard stains. <laughs> yeah. The bottom. She was the bottom was of part, the bottom. That was it. They're like, anything to get this fucking guy. Wow. What yep. Fucking, yeah. Yep. Can you can you name any of your bosses? The, your can previous I, bosses? Um, yeah. I had a previous boss at one of the department stores I worked for named uh, Debbie. She she was like she was like a psychopath yeah. though. She didn't she wasn't like out to say like oh, I'm going to get this person, no. but she would just ruin everyone's day and kind of have yeah. like no idea. Yeah. People would be having a conversation, then she would come in and talk about how uh, all of her cats were sick, and one of her cat had an ear infection, yeah. and just ruined the whole conversation. I, I, I remember the nicknames. I remember my first mm. uh, personal trainer. A uh, manager that hired me, we just called her Big Bertha. <laughs> Sounds about right. Yeah, <laughs> she, 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 you know, big lady. She didn't yeah. give a shit about she didn't give training. A, yeah, you know, she just wanted to bring numbers in. It's all numbers. That's it. Yeah, you know, all trainers are like, you know, we we just doesn't see it. Did good. everything yep. opposite. Oh you yeah, know? we were like fuck that. And then she was like, she quit one day. We how, just broke her. We how broke far her. in did you just say like fuck? I'm doing the opposite of everything you say. That's what I've always been like that. But as soon as uh, <laughs> she she started fucking with our money, I think she was fucking Ooh. with our money. She wasn't giving. Oh, she, that's she, not she good. stopped uh, giving us leads and shit. You know, they're supposed to give yeah. leads of new 
new right. members who oh, yeah, man, sure, she's sure. she didn't do that and uh, and uh, she wasn't helping us advance she wasn't helping us be better so it's just you in know? your nature to go against and yeah the my, yeah to, this to is like a National Geographic so once, was, yeah, yeah. And, I, and once I was like yo this she gotta go and then you know I'm a rebel rouser but you broke her we I I, I I can't take full credit for it. I mean, we I've all never it. like broken somebody above me. Oh, my God, she, that's she, that's, she, that's she, badass. She though. was like we. She she needed a. She quit because she needed a. She was a, under medical duress or or mental mental duress. Mental she, duress. Yeah, she, she you can like, do that. Just yeah. say like oh, I'm losing so my she, mind. She can get employment. So she was like, yeah. It's so funny because I had a manager at Macy's who did the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. Only it was she yeah, made up some stuff with her she, foot. Yeah, she for, said it was yep. too stressful. Yeah, medical. And then yeah, she quit. And then we, th- we thought we drove her crazy. But then looking back at it, it was like, yeah, she got that check. She got, she got the ah, fuck out damn of it. Damn it. She won. Or, I guess so. Yeah. But we won because we got a quieter gym and it was peaceful. It was dope. For you a won. While. You killed the. I'm thinking like David and Goliath. You killed the like a giant or the yeah, boss a giant. or something. You, you know what? Like, I can't yeah. find out. Yeah, here's here's the thing that that I've done a couple of times. When when mm-hmm. you have somebody that you don't get along with, right? Right at work, the way the mental the the uh, the way to get rid of them is just to say, "Yo, I think I'm gonna quit." Right. Because you place that bug in their head, and okay. they're, they're thinking about quitting. Right. Because and then most of the times, what they'll do is they'll go find another job. Yeah. Which is weird. Because they think you're quitting. They think you're quitting. You're like, yeah, maybe I should go quit too. And he's like, I'm going to, interesting. Yeah, it's like, it's psychology. So So you go deep with your enemies. You have like the mental chess game down. If it's bad. If it's Yeah. (laughs) (laughs) If it, uh... Yeah, I don't like being stressed out. Especially at a job that I like to do. You yeah, know, sure. It, 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 the things that I like doing, like personal training, and, and, and I don't want to like be bothered. I want to go in. I want to train my clients and leave me alone. In and out, yeah. You know, mm-hmm. I don't like people who micromanage and, and what what a lot of people do. To I, I don't know. No, nobody works well when they're micromanaged. No, That's... And it's especially a lot of times the managers who manage gyms aren't into fitness, and that's. That's I've noticed that, yeah. Some of the it's places that work out. Guy. Yeah. Some fat guy <laughs> telling all everybody else, you know, and he's, just, he's like, yeah, you guys should uh, uh, one of those he's guys. He's like, I'm a fan of fitness. I don't do I'm it, but like, anybody. yeah. Anybody. <laughs> you ever seen uh, shoes that doesn't know what any of the machines are? Mm-hmm. That just yeah. that doesn't know. Oh, that's man. Yeah, it's, I, I can like imagine. That. People, you know, who, who are into it, um, take it seriously. They like it. They love, they, they take it serious. Mm-hmm. And don't fuck with it. Um, um, also won't work. You ever, you ever work for a company that you mm-hmm. like to consume? Is that is that? We're actually like like yeah. the products or yeah. yeah. I mean that was kind of the case with the last one. But what, what were you referring like, to? I I, uh, I thought I was going to be a wing connoisseur when Ooh. I was younger, and I remember <laughs> I was I was going to um, uh, I don't know what the fuck I was thinking. I was and how young how younger were we talking about? I, I was like fresh out of college, like. You were fresh out of college and when Connoisseur was like... Was I, I, wanted to travel. I wanted to travel. I wanted to be... Because I, I, I forgot what I saw. And I, I knew I loved eating buffalo wings. Yeah. So I wanted to do something along the lines of being like a... Like a, like a just talk about food. Just like, a personality. Like, you, know, you know how... The, the yeah, like the guys have food. Before... before yeah. uh, what, what is that called? Wing... It's a, is there it's a, a wing YouTube guy? channel. So you, oh, I didn't even know. Where yeah. Eat wings and talk to guys. Yeah. I want to be like that. Oh, you want to be a personality who's just yeah, known for just huh. known for eating buffalo wings. Yeah, yeah. About buffalo wings, have my own sauce. So I was like, I'm going to research this, and I was going to have my own restaurant. I was like, okay. I read a book. It's like, if you wanted to have your own restaurant, you should work for a restaurant first. So right. You know okay. the ins and outs. So I went to work for. I was like, this is going to be great. I went to work at Buffalo Wild Wings. Oh, that's the probably not the. How did that go? It it was uh. It's always the one person. It's always yeah. one motherfucker, mm-hmm. and uh, and uh, and, I, and that's when I promised I would never work for a company that I like buying things from. Ah, smart. Because you know, it made me hate the company, and it, I know that's not fair. Do you still pursue like wings and everything? Or I, is that I don't even eat wings. That much. I was gonna say. You know, yeah. <laughs> we I, we used to have competitions. I used to do like the trivia. Just because you're healthier now, or you just got tired of them? No, I eat, I eat um different wings. I, like I'll bake my wings. I'll cook them yeah. different. I'll still eat chicken. So it's a little but, yeah. yeah I, 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 and that's what I kind of learned because uh, they all fried all their food, and I was sure, like, yeah. I don't want to eat all that fried food. Yeah, you can't. So have I started food. eating. I, I bake all my chicken, bake fried. I, I learned how to do then. Mm-hmm. I didn't know it was a fucking thing. Um, and you were still in New York during your wing that was adventure? That was, that was wing. Well, because I've heard that, like, 
I'm not a, I like wings, but I'm not a connoisseur. Yeah. I've heard New York's actually not like a great wing city. You'd be surprised. No, not, not great. No, right, but no. there's like good the spots. The best wings I had, I was, uh, I was, uh, I was, uh, Anesthesia attic, uh, in mm. uh, under anesthesia, and, and somebody brought me. I just oh. came out of the hospital and uh, just came out of anesthesia, and uh, and I was like, yeah. When I wake up, I want buffalo wings, mm. and they brought me like these the fattest. Yeah, they were, like they were. I don't know if it was. I was, I was still on drugs. But yeah, they were like they really seem perfect. perfect. <laughs> like like this, there's two <laughs> kinds of ways to make your wings. There's wet dry, wet rub, and dry rub. Yeah, like when it's cooked in the sauce. Yeah, when it's got the, yeah. you can still dip it in the in the blue mm-hmm. cheese, and then it yeah. just sticks. Yeah, and then it's the wet where where the I wish we had wings here now. We should be. Did you eat that as an example? <laughs> yeah. You yeah. 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 see it, but <laughs> there's the wet where the buffles the the sauce gets in the blue yeah. cheese. And it makes sense. Yeah, I don't know, so you can only dip right. it a couple of times yeah, before you do the whole thing. But of I like cheese. I like dry rub where everything yeah. sticks and it's perfect. Like interesting. Yeah, the sauce grabs the the blue cheese. Yeah, and these were. Like the fattest, you know, they were on steroids. Like the, the oh, fattest yeah. little wing legs. Yeah. And a, <laughs> are, you, are you a drum or a wing? I'm a, I'm a drum guy, yeah. but I don't, my parents are really like strict about it. I can go either way. Yeah. I like the drums, but my mom would be a big pain in the ass whenever we would get wings. Fridays we're getting wings. And she, would, and she would ask for like only drums and everybody yeah. at the wing place would hate her. Wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I did that too. I was like, yeah, once I knew you could add, you could yeah. get them separated, I was like, yeah, I'm a drum guy. Give yeah. me all drums. Yeah. All drums. Mm. I'm like, plus, less yeah. me. it's less me to say, I don't know. You're, you're playing around with the wings. Have you ever done like any like spicy like wing competitions or? No, we used to do them after work at, yeah. at, at B-Dubs. Um, and I won. Yeah. I always win. Uh, but I never did anything serious. We Nothing. Right. Who, 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 whoever ate the whole the fifty faster. Yeah. Um, didn't have to buy them. Oh, okay. So that right sounds there. fair. Yeah, nice. It's one of those things after yeah. after work, and then you can only do that for so much. Um, fuck that place. Uh, uh, how you how, how you doing now? Uh, I'm doing you, better. Talk to you yeah, last I've been time. Doing <laughs> lots of positivity stuff. <laughs> I've been. I was just talking about my life. It's not a punchline. So, I was yeah. meditating. I got it's like a to be continue. I, I love doing the actual follow up to when uh, when we talk to you. What, what happened last time? Because what happened last time was I talked about losing the job, uh-huh. and then the last podcast I saw you record, the girl was here and she was like saying like, "Oh, I just wrote a book," and I'm like, "God damn it! I have to come back with like something so to pitch," big. and I'm like, "All right, well, uh, is it the same girl, Sarah? I think so. Sarah, yeah. yeah, but Sarah. she had like she had her shit together and she had like things to pitch and she." Had, like, philosophies about... And then she was, like, questioning some of your behaviors. So uh-huh. That was good, too. Yeah. <laughs> and um, I'm like, oh, I really got to... I really got to bring something to the table when I uh-huh. come back. And I've been talking about chicken wings for, like... Yeah, I'm <laughs> sorry. So, I know, it's really... Um, my friend gave me some magic rocks, though, so that's been good. Magic rocks? Not really. It's... Drugs? No, not just for positivity. Oh, I've been shit. carrying around these... Yeah, this I've, jab. I got to pick up my yep. rocks for this yep. For yep. mic. Yeah, yep. and what is this called? It's This is a rose quartz, I think. It's supposed uh-huh. to ma- open your heart chakra. Open your heart chakra. Can I use your rock? Yeah, can you can I hold it. It's not actually magic. It's I thought not it was, magic? No, I thought it, it was. It yeah. helps you do stuff? It's supposed, You're supposed to, like, when you meditate, you, like, conjure, like, certain feelings. From the center and of the And it makes rock? you feel... That, yeah, I don't even know if you have to hold it, but... No. Hey, Mike Lee. Hey. Yeah, boo-boo, Hello. what's up? How are you? How are you? Yeah, I thought you were somebody else. I She's was like, the one who gave me the rocks. <laughs> <laughs> How are okay. you? Hey, you look... Never mind. Okay. Okay, Google. Google, hi, Google. Okay. You broke the podcast. Google, 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 Google. You broke in the podcast. Yeah. Like oh She's the one who gave me it. This is live on YouTube. We were just two guys sitting on stage, you know, basking in the light. Well, she's the one who gave me the rock, so it's... You gave me the rock? Yeah. Yo, yo, hey, take your jacket. You want to jump in real quick? We're going to finish up. 45. Uh, how do you know each other? Uh, we both live in Astoria. Okay. Yeah. Just two people in Astoria just hanging out. Yeah. Hi, hi, and then hi. And I started You're a comic? Yep. Yep. Who's now? Yeah, uh, uh, introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Meg Mark, stand up comedian. Yeah, you are. Uh, 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 we're talking about rocks. And, uh, what how does this help? help you? I feel more positive. Does it? I think, yeah, I think so, yeah. <laughs> is it your rock? It is. It's a rose quartz. So it opens up the heart chakra. Oh, yeah, that's what we're talking mm-hmm. about. Yeah. White girls and rocks. Yeah. Here's, here's the thing, real quick. They're making a new black Superman. 
Is this what you for Bill's up to the whole time? Yeah, no, 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 okay. no, 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 the perfect, perfect <laughs> transition. And, uh, and uh, this is how you know Superman was supposed to be black. Okay. Because his weakness is white women and and, and crystals. Is his weakness white women? Lois Lane is his weakness. Yeah, is it? Okay, I guess you're and right. And kryptonite. And kryptonite, right. yeah. No? Are regular black guys weakened by rocks? Well, now, yeah. Because well, there's, there's a, a lot of... Or they're weakened by the whitest white women who are who happen to have... Crystals. Cool. So you're saying I'm going to find my Superman? Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna, you might find you. You go into Harlem and, and just shake yeah, off a yeah, couple yeah. rocks. <laughs> they'll they'll, they'll all show up. It's like, hey! Hey, boo-boo! See, the <laughs> I was looking yep. for. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You need to go to Harlem. Yeah. 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 You need to go to Harlem and, uh, and, and just <laughs> shake those bag of rocks. All right. Is it like Superman? It's about to be. I didn't know that. Yeah, I did I don't know if it, how how far they're into it, but they, it, that's in, it's in talks. How far into it's in talks? <laughs> yeah, it's in talks. Okay. Yeah, I hope they make it. That that'll be fun to watch. You ready for it? Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> how how are you? What, what's going on with your life? I'm good. I'm good. Uh, this is my first uh, open mic I like here. Your nails. Feeling good. Thank you. Shiny. Look at that. I've been waiting for someone to notice for a got week. Got it. I'm on. Oh Jimmy's God. on it. Oh, a you week. See what's happening? It's yeah, the rocks. It's the rocks. I'm the same page. Little rocks. Why, Greg? Greg, go stop. All right. Go on. I'll take it. That's what it's for. Just to purge guys like me. You carry that around, and it's like this dude won't bother you anymore. Yeah, they'll be in the car. Um, um, yeah, what's going on? What are you struggling with? What am I struggling yeah, with? Yeah, into it. So deep. Yeah, it's the end of the podcast. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. Um, I'm struggling with uh, being natural lately. Feeling a lot of natural? a lot of pressure to to just be myself. What? So on stage, not as a person. On. Oh, I was like, oh, yeah. deep. Thank is you for speaking for me with both. I'm just, yeah, that's wow. what I do. We ever just jump in Thank there. Thank you for mansplaining like, my fucking emotions. Yeah, mansplaining fucking problem. Right? That's what I just, yep. <sighs> what are you it's just like, no, this is how the women really oh, feel. Oh, my God. <laughs> fucking Greg. Are you, are you still single? I'm still single. That's yeah. why. Yeah. Just keep your fucking mouth shut, yeah. Greg. God, all right. Let's you go. go. You need this more than yeah, I do. Thank you. Good. Where are you going? Oh. What? Where are you are going? You no, you're supposed to go. I was like, no, I'm going to get right there. talking for me no, again. Yeah. Yeah. Vote. I did. <laughs> you didn't vote? Uh, no, I did. Okay, good job. Of course I did. What else are you struggling with? What did it? I'll let you finish. In my life? What am I struggling life. with? What did you wake up this morning to? You got out of bed. You were like, fuck. Actually, I had a good morning because I got out of bed. And I actually did yoga because I've been struggling with self-care lately. Okay. I haven't had a lot of self-care. What does that mean? I haven't been cooking for myself. What? It's important to make warm meals, you know, take care of yourself. Yeah. I haven't been doing that. And I haven't been working out enough. So oh, I fuck. Come on that. now. Uh, uh, do you talk to your food? When you, when you, I know it's weird. Hmm. I, I, ask, I always ask a lot of people, do you talk to your food before you eat? I don't talk to no, Do you pray over your food? No. They, what? They, here's the thing. I, I forgot what, what documentary I saw. They were like, uh, uh, they showed the difference between, they took two glasses of water, mm-hmm. right? And they, they, they yelled at one glass, right? And then froze it. And then talked nicely to the other glass. And then froze them both. And then when they took them both out of the freeze, they, the, the one they yelled at was all cracked up and and you see the cracks in the ice. And the one that they talked nice to was a smooth block of ice. What did they like, yell at the one? I don't know. Did they, did they, they just say two glasses of water? Like, like, you know, like, yeah, you never, just <laughs> negative stuff. They, they, they tell jokes on the water. To the, I don't know. It's, it's, I think it's energy. It's all energy. They do that. Uh, they do that with plants too. They do I do study. believe in plants. Yeah, but energy. I didn't hear about ice. That's really yeah. something special. Yeah, and that's, that's why I said you should you should talk to your food and, and But do you and, say nice things, or you're like say nice things. Just you? pray. It's just, oh. just like that's why uh, people who pray over their food tend to be happier than people who who just dive in and eat. Because my friend used to talk to his food, but he would say horrible things. Well, so it wasn't was, he, was, he, was he a piece of shit? He was a yeah. No, he's just like a, he's just kind of a crazy guy. Yeah. So he's swinging yeah. at the fences. And, yeah, I, I, I believe that. that. Was I, it. it sounds weird. Yeah. But he didn't know you were gonna sit in on. I, I didn't. I didn't know there was a camera. Yeah. See, I know. That's a, I would have you back for real, for real. We just tossed you in. Um, um, what are you struggling with? What, 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 uh, what's, what's, what's happening now? now, late, now uh, I don't know. I'm struggling you got, with... You got the rocks. You got I got the rocks. New transition. Uh, I guess relationships. Now it's transition. Yeah, that's a thing. Um, I don't know. Advancing... Oh, like basic white people stuff. Advancing my career, you know. <laughs> you know, I got... Domination. Get, I, got I got to get more socks. <laughs> yeah. Good problems. Yeah, good ones. Yeah. <laughs> so lots of basic stuff. Uh, 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 what are you watching now? Oh, so we're just abandoning that. Okay. Yeah, just abandoning that. Right. There's nothing there. There's nothing I can use. <laughs> I'm the only chocolate ball here. 
I'm not. I don't have time to watch. You still watch any House of Cards? I don't. I don't do House of Cards. You cards. don't like House of Cards? Mm -mm, mm -mm. Even even with a female president? Even with a female president? Yeah. No? It's too too. Uh, you know. What's wrong with it? No. <laughs> I wish it's that's intense. the way it was now. Yeah, yeah. It's, yeah. Like, it's the dream. As close to the dream as possible, right? Yeah. Yeah. She's. It's actually. I watched one episode. Um, and and it's like they tease you to quit watching it. She's like, are you still here? She keeps saying, you know how she talks to the camera. And then I was like, well, I'm going to keep watching. It's all right. It's, it's getting better. It, you know, it's it's um, it's um, it's a different transition. My best well, friend loves that show. I've, I've been watching This Is Us. This is us. <laughs> I see the posters. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't, uh, you like it? If I don't watch it, I don't. I, like, don't get to cry that week. So. Is it sad? What is it about? Oh, my God, it's sad. Yeah, it's just about, like, a family with people who died, and it goes through everyone's lives. It's, it's just a tearjerker. That's the whole plot. Yeah. It's like, Fuck. I'm going to yeah. watch one episode. You're going way deeper on This Is Us than you did any of my issues. So, <laughs> so. <laughs> Just to recap. <laughs> well, we did. We talked. Yeah, yeah, you're right. You're right. That's, yeah, that's fine. Even before I got here, you were talking about me. So I don't know what I was, issues. No, you're it was welcome. Kind of you're you're like, like, what's the origin you're of the like, rock? Summoned her in. She's like, right there. And she showed up in the doorway. That was, yeah, that was <laughs> pretty like creepy. summoned her through the rock. Right, yeah. Which is pretty dope. Yeah. yeah. That's energy, right? Summons white women. <laughs> you got to get a pink rock to summon white women. That's yep. <laughs> I have an orange one, too. I haven't tried that. I don't know if yeah, it's going to show up who, with that who, yet. Who? I don't know. It's like a Jersey girl. Oh, probably. Uh, yeah. yeah. She's like, too. Can I get one of them? Happy. <laughs> that one does help with self-confidence, so it's probably... So probably, probably what's going to... Yeah, exactly. I had a silver one. Was it like... A, a silver one? It, it was some... Uh, some uh, 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 was, I want to say he was a weird, a weird. I don't want to. A weird gay guy gave it to me. He was weird. He was, he was just a weird guy <laughs> on the train. He was like, "I feel like you need some power." And, and I was going to like, "Yeah." Eh. I was That's having cool, a, a, a character building day, so he's like, he grabbed my hand, he put the rocket in my hand. He was like, "This is going to give you all the power you need." And then he just walked away. It was like I expected something creepy, but he, he, it was cool. It was That's cool. Really so nice. I just kept the rock, and, and I was like, "I care." And things, <laughs> I'm really changed. <laughs> Things got things change. I really like, love that you called it a character building day. I'm not even being a dick. Like that's a really positive way to spin it. Like no, I, I don't. I don't say good and bad days. I say it, a day, character day, building a day. character building day. Like a day where you face challenges or you're just learning it's, lessons. It's, 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 most people say a bad day or a shit day. Right. Or it's just not going your way, but those days make you better. Wow. So I, I did that to someone once on yeah. the train. Not yeah. a crystal though. I had a jar full of quotes that I had handwritten. Yeah. And I was giving them to someone as a friend, and I saw this girl. She was like crying. Yeah. She had. Crutches. She had the whole like she's yeah, having. She's a, so I just day. like found a good quote for her, and I was like, "Here." And she thought I was fucking crazy. Yeah, but most people do it first. <laughs> I wonder if she. Either some people me. take yeah. it, and all you can do is give the give good energy out. Right? Yeah. You know? What were and some then, of the quotes you had written now? Yeah. Oh, just just a million. I mean, anything you can think of, like. Uh, but you didn't know what you gave her. Women need a bicycle, like. And That's women what, need men like fish need a bicycle something like that. <laughs> yeah, but it, was, it wasn't funny. that one. For I, her. I would I would make I would make a bunch of good quotes and then slide in like a batshit crazy quote <laughs> just just in case like like the moon the sun hug on Venus or some some bullshit. That's right. <laughs> just in like, just in case whoever gets that he cause deserve. trouble. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> Never speak to squirrels. <laughs> and then that person takes that quote and tries to base their whole life around it. Like, what does it mean? And you end up just ruining their life. <laughs> and he to win the forest. <laughs> <laughs> like, what does this mean? And they just change their whole life to figure it out. There should be a super villain who just does that. It ruins it gives, everybody's gives quotes. shitty, yeah. weird quotes ruins out. Ruins life with Like never quotes. sit in two chairs at the same time. Like, that's what? That's not a bad piece of advice. That's, that's Sometimes you'll try to... Sit in two chairs? Yeah, they're too close together and you're like... You're on the train and you're sitting in that middle... If it's on like our train, yeah. And for It's weird. It's like standing in a doorway. It's, it just feels oh, weird after a while. Always give your seat to midgets. I don't know. Do you give up your seat to like... Like really overweight people. I don't give my seat to anybody anymore. Oh, and, and, and that's super hard because unless you like, a lot, like I don't give my seat. No, not pregnant women. Not to nobody. <laughs> to nobody. I'm not pregnant women. Oh. I don't because what if she's not pregnant, and I assume she's pregnant. Oh my god, that's you're the like, worst. You're, you're like a that. subway oh, conspiracy theorist. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, you want to say, I'm not pregnant. You got to go through that and sit the whole, whole train ride. Or, man, I just called her fat. And then 
Uh, you know? I see where you're yeah. And especially... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I you thought know, you were like, yeah, like a conspiracy theorist. Like, yeah. all, the, all the women are conspiring to be pregnant. No, no, no. Okay. Just, you, so, nowadays, you don't know. Because when people are... Yeah, there's fat people. There's fat there. people. And you go, hey, you look pregnant. Maybe you want to sit? Get, get up. No, just get, get up. Get up. <laughs> yeah, some, some, some lady, they... they uh, I don't know who. Uh, there's a certain alpha woman. I right, can't say that alpha woman who alpha likes. Say whatever you want. Your pa. Who who <laughs> likes? Who like because you know I don't want to offend anybody. But but <laughs> you know everybody's so similar. But but they love telling me to get up when when there's a pregnant woman and they like fighting for it and I'll, I'll pretend like I'm asleep and be like, sir, can you get up? They'll do the whole gesture like they they want a war because they want to. Yeah. They they want to. Yeah. They want to be the one to be like, yeah, I'm a good person. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. For them, I'd be like, all right, I'm good. But, but well, no, no I, I stopped. I stopped. stopped. I, I, I don't know. I, I, I you up your seat to pregnant ladies like you stopped smoking meth. You're like, yeah, I'm, because <laughs> I was, uh, and then yeah. they feel like they're gonna talk. You're gonna talk. To, I don't want to hit on you. I just, I'm trying. I was trying to be a gentleman. And then, because that's what somebody told me, they'd be like, hey, some girls, I'd be like, hey, would you want, you want to see, I see, they'll be on the train, and they'll be like, rubbing their foot in front of you, mm-hmm. like, like, like they have sore feet, okay. and then I'll be like, hey, you want to sit? And they'll be like, no, I don't want to sit, and then I'll get up the next stop, and you will sit down. Oh, I see what you mean. I was like, I just, why, and then I'm like, why wouldn't you take my seat? No, I'm offended. It's a character well, building day. They were being nice. They were being nice to you in exchange for your politeness. But I feel like you just want to pump me just to ask. Oh, no. like, like you just want me to ask. Not you just want to ask. <laughs> it, not it gets deep. Thing. I was like, <laughs> Have you ever had a lady get upset at you for manspreading? No, I don't manspread. Because okay. my, my uh, I, got, I got a, and I know why men manspread. All right, and uh, and I know why I manspread because I got a weak weak muscle. Mm-hmm. So what I do is I put my bag on my leg and I strap it so I keep my legs closed. That's oh, cool. nice. so, at least keep your legs. So yeah, I, I, so, so keep because I know I know my my leg drifts. So I, and and I can't control that. Um, um, but then why guys do it is because their uh, their their muscles are weak. Oh, interesting. So any guy who manspread probably can't fuck too good. That's where that comes. Oh, from. <laughs> that's good to know. Yeah. So, I don't fuck so, guys, but yeah. that's good enough. <laughs> so that ladies like, hey, your 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 uh, your adductors are weak. So you, you tell a guy that you need to work those out because he can't keep them closed. That's why he manspreads. Wow. Yeah. I don't manspread. You, so you, I'm you learn stuff. You learn stuff, it. guys. Yep. <laughs> so which is worse? Are you supposed to fuck the guy who manspreads? No, but stands no. up for other people. Ooh. Or the guy wait, 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 who's wait, wait, good at keeping their legs together, but the fuck stand up to be polite. Fuck the guy that keeps his legs together. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. obviously. <laughs> yeah. It's the rock. Yeah, you yeah. fucked yeah. up. It's the, the yeah. rock. You see, it's working. I, I wanted to start spinning when we start talking. I want you to be like, mess. <laughs> yeah. Where's that rock? When we say good stuff, it spins. And, I, don't I don't know what you're. It's just some, a real magical rock, but I don't know. Uh, shut up, Jimmy. Um, um. Where can they find you on social media? Uh, you can Did just you get have your me. shit together yet? No. <laughs> wow. Wow. I have a blog where I review movies. Do you it's blog? Not really, uh, yeah, but it's just... What is it called? Uh, it's called... Oh, my God. I'm not, it's called Midnight Rambler. It's named after a Rolling Stones song. It's a better song, title. It's, I know the Midnight Rambler. You don't like it? Okay, No, fine. terrible title. Terrible title. But, but, no. <laughs> but it's That's better than mine. That's what What's I, your I, I have a t- It's called the uh, Movie Hopping with the Peoples. Oh really? Yeah, but I've never done anything with it. It's just I, I'm it's good. I'm, movie, you both, and it's about movies. Yeah, yeah, it's about movies. All right. I was, I was supposed to. I was gonna go movie hop and see two movies a day and take comics and then. But this should never happen. That's a fun idea. Yeah. yeah. If, so if you ever want to go and uh, let's do it. Well, you, let's that's go. I'm taking yours. That's yeah. me. That's you, movie hop, you could be one of the people. So yeah. Just, just whatever. Good. Say it again. Happens. Movie happen with, with the people. With the people. That's me. That's where you can find. <laughs> I'm taking it. You, you can run it. You can I'm, run it. Yeah. You can run it. I'm Absolutely. Um, I was gonna go see Overlord tonight. Uh, uh, okay. Overlord, uh, which is like a French war movie. Yeah. We're not talking that. about that. We'll, we'll talk about it next yeah. week. Um, where, where can you find? Me? That's it. Uh, and then you can add me on Facebook. Good. Hey. What's the last movie you reviewed? Last movie I reviewed. Yeah. Uh, it was a French movie. Of course it was. Yeah. yeah. It was, a long, it was an old one, though, so you, nobody cares. So you don't do, like, new movies? Man. No, I do, because I do older movies, but ones that screen in New York and, like, the repertory theaters and okay. everything. So it could be something old, but I'll be like, oh, but if you're interested, you can go see it at this location or this location. Okay. Uh, uh, Twitter? Twitter, yeah. I'm, no, I'm not on Twitter. Either. Instagram? Yeah, I'm on Instagram. I'm start doing movie, t- one-line one movie reviews on Twitter. 
Would you do? Does anybody do that? That's a good idea. Really? Just, just a quick sweep. Like this movie sucked because bop, and be done with it. So, yeah, because that's all you want to know. Was it good or bad? Should I go see it or should I bootleg it? The most time I'll bootleg it, and then if it's bad, I won't see it. But if it's good, I'll still pay for it. Oh, okay, that's fair. Huh? The end of the movie in Twitter. Just the end of the end, spoiler alerts. <laughs> spoiler alert tweets? Oh, oh Brad Cooper fine. dies. Like, oh, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Spoiler alert tweet. Good job. Um, um, where can they find you? Uh, you can find me at MegYourMark. MegYourMark. That's, that's smart. My name's Meg Mark. MegYourMark.com. That's super smart. Thank you. Or Muggy Mark on Instagram. Smarter. Muggy Mark. <laughs> you just like <laughs> you like the sound of it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> anytime you say your stuff twice, you really like it. Yeah, yeah. Really like it. I thought long and hard about it, unlike some people. I'm like, yep. I was, I was thinking about my, my uh, I've never had a kids, but if I had a daughter, I would name her J-I-M-M-I, and then I would name another one J-Y-M-M-I, and then we all would just be Jimmy's, and then I have a son named J-I-M-M-Y Jr., that's good. I don't that's know a, why I was thinking that's about That's a worse idea than my blog yeah. title. I was, I was, I was yeah. thinking somebody was like, that's a terrible that's a idea. Word. Yeah. <laughs> I, I'm going to with you. If I have a son, I'm going to do Marky Mark. So it's a... Uh, you sh- absolutely yeah, should. Right? Yeah, right? Like, they're not yeah. going to get it, because, but his parents would be like, that's a cool kid. All the <laughs> Vietnamese kids will be like, look out. Marky Mark. <laughs> <laughs> Mark Wahlberg. Uh, 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 is your website? Guy. Hmm? Your website? Yeah, Meg Your Mark. Meg Your Mark. What else is there? Uh, Facebook, Meg Mark. Got shows coming up? Um, no. <laughs> I like the, um. <laughs> uh, we'll see. Stay I, like, I like the no show, um. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, keep it up for them. Thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you for popping up. I'll have you back again. If you don't hate that guy. <laughs> uh, it's another episode of the people. Hey, Billy, did you, were you at the mic yesterday? Yeah. How was it? It was good. It was good? She did, she did it good? Yeah. Okay, good job. I, I like when I when I have guest hosts on, but then they, I ask them how they did. They be like, "Yeah, I killed it," and then somebody will come up and be like, "That was terrible." She was <laughs> but uh, I like I like getting Billy's. Um, uh, I don't respect him for anything else except for his opinion when I'm not here. He tells me he tells me uh, he tells me all the, the if it's negative, he'll give me a negative review. Uh, uh, but you can find this on uh, Spotify, iHeartRadio, uh, wherever you can find podcasts, uh, la, 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 jimpeoples.com, subscribe to our YouTube channel. I like Point. point I was going to say, yeah, I'm point doing makes it, it makes it as, important. Yeah. Uh, J People's TV, and you can go to Alexa, and this is episode, what is it? That's like episode 5,000? 218. Oh, episode 218. Say Alexa, I want to hear episode 218. And, uh... This is the mic. The mic follows the podcast every day, Monday to Friday at 3 o'clock. Cool? Great. All right. Give it up for yourself. Thank you. Appreciate it.